things. So it's great that the youngers here are here now and listening to, you know, it's a changing of hands, a next generation, a next generation, next generation. And this is what we have to do to keep it going. So that's where I'm coming from and I'm here today. So, yeah. Can I just ask, is there any uh, person here who has a sound system or is thinking of um, uh, starting a sound system? Several of you. And, and do you find that the... Um, Oops, sorry, sorry. Do you find that the, uh, you have the enough information out there for you to make decisions uh, about, say, building amplifiers or, or what kind of sound that you want? Is the information out there? Depends where you're based. We're um, based over Bournemouth, so really, uh, yeah, I've got to travel to find something that's not a uh, real traditional lots of sounds being based there, although Shackleton. explain to him and some of the others that when you first have the desire to set up a sound system, what's the first thing that you should concentrate on? Um, well, when I first built my sound system, obviously it was the research of listening and um, attending dances. I used to go to a lot of dances when I was younger, um, just listening to the sounds and how they were playing, looking at their boxes, what wires they were using, what plugs they were using, how are they getting so much power to play the stuff from where like, oh, I can see 13 amp plugs and all of these different things. There's a lot of science behind the sound system. I didn't want to come here and, and, and um, glamorize, give you the glamorized version. You know, you see some boxes and you rave, you dance, and you blah, 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 like it's just something so easy because there's a lot of hard work, I'm telling you, and a lot of tired, tiredness that goes into building a sound system and a lot of science. So when I was building, I, I, I first was, um, all I was doing was printing off things off of the internet. So like what people do now, doing their research. Obviously I had my father, but I was doing my own research. I need to understand, nobody cannot tell me. I need to understand for myself how I'm going to approach this situation of what I wanted to do. Um, so I was printing off things off of the internet and I made a folder of all people's stuff that I liked and I was taking notes, like how people were here taking notes, I was taking notes in dances. I like how he's using that. I like that wire format of how he's doing that. And I created a big massive folder, and then I, I found out there were some builders who were building sound systems, as in the, the carpenters, and I went to them and I said, what do you think about this idea? What do you think about that idea? So I, I, that was about three or four years of intense research, of going to, to dances, talking to different people, talking to my elders and doing my own, you know, my own self-finding of what I wanted to accomplish because building a sound system, you're going to spend about 20k. That's, I would say that is a minimum. If you're going to build a proper sound system, it's going to, you're, going to, you're going to spend money. So you need to know how you're going to spend the money and why. It's like, I see it as any other business, any other business, you know, People might see it as like it's entertainment, it's just that I see it as it's business, you know? Because at the end of the day, everybody's got to make a living. The venue has to be paid for. The speakers have to be paid for. The people who are helping you need to be paid. So you need to make sure that you need to know where it's going, that it's going to be sustainable for you financially. So this is why a lot of sounds, you see a lot of sounds nowadays springing up. You, we, we had that, you know, back in the 80s, a, a sound explosion, but then it dives, it goes down, because people realise the amount of work that takes to, to run these things. They understand that the, the sustainability is very high. The maintenance is very high. When you blow a speaker, bam, £250. You need to take it there, you need to send it to the guy, he's going to send it back to you. All of these kind of things. So I see it, like I said, I see it as a business, so I wanted to know. Like any business plan, if anybody here is studying business and economics or any of those kind of things, you have to do a business plan. What are your intentions? How are you going to get there? You have to use all of your strategies and find out how you're going to get to that point. So this is what I was doing in the very beginning. And I'm in that process. I've stuck to what I wanted to do. I haven't strayed. Um, and I'm still reaching where I need to reach. I haven't reached yet, but I'm doing everything that I said I would do. So, yeah. Thank you.
<laughs> That's all we have time for. Is that true? Thank you very much. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, so um, my first answer is, I, I, I started my, my mother, my mother's here so she can tell you, I started when I was about 14, 14, 15 in the events, and when I say in events, I was putting on the events. Like I said, I started at the Albany, at Albany I put on two shows, two local community uh, shows for young people called Talent in the Community, that was also uh, backed by the National Theatre, that was also backed by Jenny Harris, uh, rest in peace, you know, and a lot of different guys that were involved in that running of that, those kind of things. So what I found is that nobody's going to give it to me instantly. No matter what my name is, no matter who I am, no matter where I'm coming from, no matter what, I have to be the one to go in, do my research, scout out venues, find out what I can do, how I can do it, work out my own feasibility, and put on a dance. If 10 people come, 10 people come. If 15 people come, 15 people come. But you just keep it running and you work within your budget. Don't try to go to from zero to 100 take your time and this is what I find a lot of the new sounds need to do just take your time and you will reach there just just do whatever you can manage so I would just say invest in yourself like any other company just invest and know how you're gonna make that money back and just keep yourself bubbling don't try and run before anyone can walk just 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 you know just sustain yourself <laughs> <laughs>